The 189th Annual General Conference for the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints begins this weekend. If you're planning to watch conference downtown, there are a few things you need to know about. ABC4's Jason Wynn is live there at the conference center. Jason, what's the one big thing people need to make sure they're doing so they can get inside the building? Well, good morning, Emily and Brian. We know a lot of our viewers like to bring water bottles wherever they go, but the church is asking folks to bring clear water bottles like this one and not metal ones like this one. Now, this is all to keep members safe. The other thing that members should know is that they don't want you to bring large bags or suitcases with you. They are asking you to think about things like you're going to the BYU game. You'll want to bring that clear bag with you to get into the conference. Now, the biggest issue for the church is firearms. Church leaders say don't bring them, they'll keep their members safe. Who are well trained, uh, they go through training before conference, uh, they work hand in hand with our security team, and we feel like it's the, it's the best process to keep us as safe as we can be. Now, UTA is increasing their bus and their transit lines to help out members. We're told that the green lines and blue lines will be increased and the bus schedules will too. And there is also other good news if you're heading down to South Salt Lake into Sugar House. They've increased the or doubled the rail lines there, so they're able to run that S train for about every 15 minutes. So it's good news for all the people trying to get in and around the city during the general conference. And we're going to keep you completely updated on everything for the general conference over the weekend. So stay tuned with ABC4 News. I'm Jason Wynn, live downtown ABC4 News.